Welcome to Discovering Love Lies Bleeding. My name is Sasha, coming at you from the depths of KSKC TV. Gentlemen, please introduce yourselves. My name's Daniel, lead guitarist, backup vocals. My name's Aaron, rhythm guitar. Matthew, I'm on the bass. My name is Tave, lead vocals. And my name is Doug, and I play the drums. So where does the band name Love Lies Bleeding come from? Good question. Um, Love Lies Bleeding was a song that I wrote when uh, our sister died. Mine and Aaron were, were brothers. Uh, she died in 2006 <clears throat> in a tragic car accident. And uh, it was initially called Hannah's Song. And we were throwing around band names. And uh, Tave over there came up with Love Lies Bleeding. And I incorporated that into the, uh, the song. It fit, and it fit for the uh, band name, so that's our title track, Love Lies Bleeding. And it just means uh, somebody that, you know, love lies bleeding. It, it, everyone can relate to somebody dying and, you know, losing somebody. So that's where it came from. What is your past band experience? Uh, I've been playing guitar since the age of 17. Uh, shortly after uh, learning to play, our father was kind of like the Jackson father. He just forced me to go out there and play and make him money. <laughs> he didn't, but uh, I did. I did go right into the to the bars and was playing with him and cover music. Me and Aaron both, and um, yeah, I've been playing in cover bands mostly, and this is my first metal band. Um, I started playing when I was 11 and started playing covers with our dad, same as Daniel, and then I went on. I played with In Memory of out of Billings, Montana, These Final Days, and Eye for Indifference. And then now I'm here, so. Um, I've never been in a band, apparently. Um, I was classically trained as a violin. <laughs> uh, I play bass now, so, yeah. <laughs> I, I think I've been playing music since I was about 12, and I sang in a bunch of quartets and choirs and different things growing up. Uh, I've been and played in bands like Cross Tribe and Tribal Fire, uh, The Love Warriors. Uh, last Man Standing was my last band. And then Daniel asked me to jump in with these guys for, for Love Lies Bleeding. And this is where we are right now. And I've been playing since I was in high school. Um, I'm going to date myself here, but I've been with the local band Warcry for the past about 22 years. Uh, uh, I don't know, 11 or 12, 13 years ago, uh, we had another band called Seventh, which uh, was a guy that actually recorded Warcry's first CD. He had a bunch of songs wrote. so. We uh, played under the name Seventh with him for a while, uh, but yeah, Work Ride has pr been pretty much my gig for the past 22 years. Uh, I met Daniel through uh, Alvin, who's our one of our guitar players and singers in War Cry, and uh, they were trying to jam around and get something together, so that's they got a hold of me, and uh, I guess that's history. <laughs> what are your musical influences? Justin Bieber. Uh, sort of what I'm jamming to right now. That's in my MP3 player right now, actually. Um, Britney Spears, another big one. No, like Kill Switch Engage. Uh, that's where I get a lot of my, my guitar from there. Everything from Steve Ray Vaughan to uh, Lamb of God. Obviously, I'm wearing that shirt. Um, yeah, just uh, wherever there's good vocals and good guitar work, that's, where, that, what, that's what stands out to me. Creed, stuff like that. Um, I'd say probably uh, Creed and Alter Bridge and Kill Switch as well and uh, Across the Sun. I, I like those guys a lot. A little more old school. My influences are Jimi Hendrix and Led Zeppelin and uh, the old school heavy metal. But uh, new, I like uh, yeah, Kill Switch Gage and uh, Lamb of God and uh, Chimera. I don't know, I grew up on a wide range of music, but as far as rock and metal goes, I'd say All That Remains, As I Lie Dying, and War of Ages are probably some of my biggest influences. Well, I came up in the 80s, so it's mostly old 80s thrash, uh, you know, Metallica, Slayer, Megadeth, Anthrax, uh, Testament. Uh, later on, yeah, <laughs> Poison, <laughs> Rat. <you know. laughs> uh, uh, later on, got into death metal, hardcore, I mean, just a little bit of everything. Um, yeah, you know, new metal came out. I even loved the heck out of that. I know, guilty pleasure, I guess, back when new metal came out. Uh, 
I guess uh, grunge killed my favorite music. <laughs> <laughs> Where the band Love Lies Bleeding, this song is called The Cost. <laughs>
nailed it. Good thing that was a really hard one. Who would be your dream band or act to open for? Again, I just kind of fantasize about doing a dance routine with Justin Bieber. <laughs> no, Kill Switch Engage, man, if I could open up for them. And uh, I'd probably be too nervous to even play, really. I'd just suck up there. But yeah, if I could uh, open up for them, I think that'd be my dream band to open up for. Um, I don't have a particular band for me. My brass ring would be getting to play the Download Festival in Europe. Yeah. That would be the one for me. Uh, I guess I'd open up for anybody if I could. I think if, if I could pick one of my favorite metal bands to open up for, I would say I'd want to do As I Lie Dying. Those guys have been my heroes for a long time. And, and I'm kind of with Aaron, you know, I don't really have a band that... that <laughs> I hope it's this band, you know, I'd, I'd like to play a big festival, that would just, that would be the thing for me, that'd be great, yeah. This song is called Love Lies Bleeding.
What are some future projects you have coming up? Future projects. Um, right now, we're really focusing on well, trying to get our message out there. Um, we don't want to be known as one of these uh, real negative bands because we're not like that, and we're not we're not partiers or stuff, something like that. You know, we're not about that. And we're, we're some of us are kind of older, so it's not like you know. We're doing this, I'm doing this just to, because I've always done it. I've always played music, and our, our, right now we are working on recording, so. I guess I can just be the one that answers that. <laughs> this song is called Call Your Name.
How can fans get a hold of you? Uh, we have a Facebook page, Love Lies Bleeding on Facebook. Um, that's a really good way to keep in contact with the band. Uh, booking is on there. Um, our email's on there. And uh, yeah, I make events on there whenever we're going to play, and you can check it out there. Awesome. This has been Discovering Love Lies Bleeding. Keep it metal. <laughs>